Good morning. How y'all doing today? This is Kay. Happy Sunday morning. Miss Kay been up in here cooking, y'all. I started me a 15 bean soup yesterday when I got off work. And uh, I just did my cornbread and I tasted it. Now, this is, uh, I'm going to show y'all the little packet. I kept it so y'all can see it. It's a 15 bean soup. It comes with a little ham flavor packet. Okay, now. I just put this thing back on my finger so I wouldn't bump it. I just combed my head to me to help me. But here we go. So this is the 15 bean soup. I added tomatoes. I fried some fat back and pulled the grease in there for seasoning. Now these are some smoked turkey. You see it? Ooh, can't hardly lift it. And I added, we had tomatoes, garlic, seasoned it real good. It's been cooking ever since yesterday around 2 o'clock. And I did the smoked turkey in a separate pot. Then I added it in. I was going to take the meat off the bone, but I said, no, that's all right. And it had some wing tips in it. Let me show you those. Yes. And um, this is going to be some all-day eating, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And I tasted them, and they are delicious. I wish y'all could smell that. Ooh. Okay, now that's my 15 bean soup. And then I did a pan of cornbread over here. And I browned the top of it, y'all. It is so good. And I used almond milk. That's just keeping it warm because I ain't too long to hit that. And I took me a little piece of it. Good morning, good morning. Look, Miss K got to sit up, get ready for church. I got my little blanket. I throw my pillows on the floor. So... Y'all get ready for some church, but I'm going to get y'all the daily bread first, and I think I'm going to do it separate. Miss K is off today. I most definitely am. How y'all doing? I am off today. I'll never be off on no Sunday, y'all. This is a blessing for real. Okay, I'm going to put it right there. And we're going to get on in with the daily bread. I'm thinking about putting my kit in my head today. My hair is so thick, y'all. Is this the world's best sandwich? No. Lance's real peanut butter between two toasted crackers is the best. Pick up some tasty sandwich crackers from Lance. North Carolina. Sorry, y'all. I'm here. Yeah, I, um, this is the gel and stuff I got. Y'all remember this? And this is the kit that I had got. And I think I'm going to actually put it in today. I'm going to see. Because, see, I want to get a shape up. Because my hair is so deep. Oh, Lord. I've been using that Dax grease, y'all. See, this is the little, little wave thing you put in. And this is the moisturizer. See, it's a little texturizer for me, but my hair is so thick and, and I can't take live products and it'll break off so quick. So I just, I don't use this before and it's, it, it works. And this is the little uh, moisture pack, the shampoo, and this, of course, you know, you put your little oil or whatever around your edges and put that on your hair, let it sit. And, you know, work it through, then rinse it out, then wash it, then condition it, and then put some activate on it. You're good to go. I think this whole process probably take no more than an hour, 30 minutes, you know, 15 to 30 minutes to let it sit in, all depending on how thick your hair is. Okay, y'all, let's get on in with the daily bread, because I'm off today, and I, I'm just going to take care of me today. Eat my soup and my cornbread and just relax all day. And I think the daily bread is coming out of 1 Corinthians. So let's get to it. Yes, 1 Corinthians 15 and 2. By which also ye are saved, if ye keep in memory what I preached unto you, unless ye have believed in vain. Again, that's 1 Corinthians 15 and 2. As Christians, we move by faith and never by sight. Just because we cannot see God with our physical eye does not mean that he is not 
real because he is. The Christian walk is a walk of faith. We live contrary to the world that bases all their beliefs on what they can see, hear, and touch. If we forfeit our faith and we do not believe in Christ, all our efforts will be in vain. Prayer. Dear God, I ask that you help me remain faithful to the cause. Lord, whenever temptation or doubt comes my way, may you give me strength to turn away from them and focus on you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. I don't even believe my head was on the the thing. Okay, fleeting or everlasting, which would you prefer? That's a story by David Jacobs. Now we're going to the quiz. By which also ye are saved, if ye keep in memory what I preach unto you, unless ye have believed in vain. The choices are Joel. Nahum, 1 Corinthians, and Exodus. 1 Corinthians. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed the daily bread. Yep, Miss Kay is off today. I got a church right there. I was telling y'all yesterday. I might. I might go. I don't know. I don't really want to rest because I got to go back to work tomorrow. Any excuse is better than none, but I will get it in on the radio. That's for sure. See, here go the little instructions. <laughs> I don't need them, but I like looking over them, you know. In case they changed a uh, product or something. Okay, here go the ones in English. Yep, yeah, Miss K might throw this on in this morning. I don't cook my Sunday dinner. I got time on my hand. See, man? They give you the little instructions how to put it in. Because my hair is thick. That deck has been working, y'all. So, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Um, enjoy the day of the bread. I'm going to get over here and get this radio set up because it's about that time for uh, church. So, I'm going to go ahead and end this video, and then I'll be back with some preaching. Here come now. Talk to you guys in a minute. Bye now.